Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Joe with JAC Baseball Collector coming back at you with another video. Today we've got a subscription box, the base box. This is put together by a guy in the LSU Maniac Facebook group named uh, Ramiro Robles. He actually has a YouTube channel as well. I believe it's just called the Robles Channel. Uh, he does some nice, you know, breaks on there. He opens up a lot of retail, pulls some pretty cool stuff. Uh, so I'll definitely link that to the description below. Um, but he puts this you know, nice little subscription box together with a nice variety of packs. It will run you $70, which is definitely on the more affordable side compared to where a lot of subscription boxes are at these days. Um, you know, a lot of them are increasing their prices, like the Rookie Card Explosion Box just increased their price, uh, Boom Box just increased their price. And I mean, you know, you can't blame them in a way just because of the price of wax. They, you know, have to be able to, to pay for the stuff. But um, this is definitely a very nice, affordable option with some some very cool, um, very nice products in there. So here's your list. You put your little, a little uh, literature in there. Here's his March volume. He's got 87 Donruss, uh, 2017 Tops Update, 18 Series 1, 19 Series 1, 2020 Heritage Miners, 2020 Heritage High Number, uh, 2020 Tops, or yeah, 2020 Tops Series 1, 2020 Tops Chrome Update, 2020 Bowman, uh, which looks like it's retail, and then 2021 series one so you know not the not super high impacts but these are you know this is a very very nice lineup for um for 70 dollars that's for sure so i'm gonna get that off to the side so we know who we're chasing and it looks like he threw in a little team bag of it looks like dj will make you on the top there so i'm gonna guess uh because he knows my pc is the yankees he threw in um, you know, it throws in a bunch of stuff for your collection. So we got a DJ LeMahieu, Cannon Smith, Glaber. There's a nice Mariano Rivera. There's a Derek Jeter, Goose Gossage, Reggie Jackson, Garrett Cole, Aroldis Chapman, Thurman Munson. And those are all out of archives, that, that whole set right there. Luis Gill, a Jonathan Loisega rookie card, Chance Adams rookie card. It's Devi Garcia, Bowman Platinum. I actually like that card a lot. Um, Glaber, Bowman Platinum. Anthony Seeger, Siegler, Bowman Platinum. Chance Adams, rookie, Bowman Platinum. A rookie performer's Aaron Judge. Wow, so this is this is Aaron Judge uh, rookie year. So 2017 Judge out of Heritage. Insert rookie, very nice. And this is a stadium club. I kind of carved reprint. So this was this was Jeter Stadium Club rookie. I was gonna say, wow, you threw a Jeter rookie in there. Uh, but that's the Stadium Club uh, reprint. Then there's a Glaber. Um, I think they call that a, you know ice from from Bowman Platinum. Very nice. And then a Garrett Cole out of 2020 Holiday with the red scarf on. So that's a short print. Let's see if we can see the number on there. 71. I think that's the regular uh, the regular short print. So. Very nice. Thank you. Thank you for tossing that in, Ramiro. That's a very nice little perk uh, that you put into these boxes. Very, very nice. So we'll set those off to the side. Make a little stack there, and we'll, we'll take out all of our packs. So this is the 87 Donruss, the 17 Update Hobby, 18 Series 1 Hobby, uh, 19 Series 1 Hobby, is there something at the bottom here? It looks like there might be a little hit pack at the bottom here. So let's pop the, our base box up in the background there. There's your Heritage High number, your 2020 update, your 2020 Series 1, your Bowman Retail Pack, your 2021 Series 1. Here's a 2010 update, which I don't believe was on his featured list, so this is a bonus pack. And then there's the 2020... Um, Carriage minor league. So let me figure out what order I want to bust these open in. Um, we'll go like this. We'll do the heritage stuff, and then we'll do the update. And then I'll figure out the rest at the end there. So let's start out with this stack first. Now we got that hit at the end. I don't want to forget about it, so I'm gonna leave it right up there. So here's 87 Donruss. We're gonna be looking for. Um, Greg Maddox, Bo Jackson, Barry Bonds, uh, Barry Larkin, Mark McGuire. So you have a lot of uh, pretty nice guys in this set. This was always a pretty cool design. It's a little before my time. Um, didn't have much 87 Donruss as a kid, but 
you know, going back and seeing some of these cards are very, very cool. A uh, little set there. No really notable names quite yet. Don Slott. Mookie Wilson's not terrible. And Curtis Wilkerson. So nothing going on in that first pack. And we got the puzzle piece. It looks like this is a Roberto Clemente puzzle. Let's do the 2020 Heritage Miners. So there's a number number of guys in this, and I'm blocking myself on the uh, on the cheat sheet there. With the, had some packs on top of it. Heritage Miners in this. You know, the so your normal guys: Franco, Bobby Wood Jr., um, Adley Rushman is in this. C.J. Abrams, Julio Rodriguez. So you know the usual names. There's Andy Pages. He's a nice one. Nico. Shea Langliers, and ERA leaders, Daz Cameron, saves leaders, and a Braylon Marquez, who I expect will be a rookie in Series 2. I think he was a rookie in, um, was he was in Donruss, I believe. So here's Heritage High Number. Really, the, the really main guy you're chasing in this is, is going to be uh, Luis Robert. Let me see if on this, if on this cheat sheet here he's got anybody else noted. Uh, Luis Roberts, Shogo, Willie Castro, and Devin Williams. So, yeah, Robert's really your big one. Jake Fraley, he's not terrible. There's Castellanos, Tyrone Taylor, Kyle Gibson. There's a then and now of Chris Bryant. I think I, I think I have that card. Of all the, I think I have two of those already. I barely opened any high number. That might be my third of those. Nomar Mazzara, Dallas Keuchel, John Birdie, and a Cameron Maven. So let's see if we hit any high numbers. Probably not because we got the insert. So not a whole ton going on in that pack. We got a 2020 Tops update. A lot of the same guys. You're going to be looking for Luis Robert. Um, and let's see. Nope. There's a Trout. There's another Trout. Oh, and we got a Relic. So that's a Andrew McCutcheon, number two, 199 Major League Materials Relic card out of Tops update. So... That is definitely not terrible. Uh, Andrew McCutcheon's a nice, nice little player. So we will pop that up back there. We got Harper, Matt Davidson, Diaz, and that is it. Actually, that was update series. So Robert was in series two. So really, update we would have been looking for a bunch of the rookie debuts, um, and. Than the likes of uh, Grisham and Rosarina in their updated jerseys. So I actually had that wrong. This is a Topps Series 1, 2021 Series 1 Hobby Pack. We've done a lot of Series 1. So we get this one out of the way. Bregman, Lizardo Future Stars, a Christian Javier and a Spencer Howard. Those guys always come back to back. There's an Evan White rookie card. And there's a pretty cool Ichiro insert. Very nice. I like that one a lot. Big fan of Ichiro. That's Gordon. And that'll wrap out that pack. So I'll just tidy up my piles here. Let's see what we've got left here. So let's let's get into 2019 Series 1. So in 2019 Series 1, you're going to be looking for... I should know this, but I always forget. Oh, this is the Kyle Tucker... Ramon Laureano, Michael Kopech, Brandon Lau, and uh, Jeff McNeil set. So this is definitely the weaker of the two. And there's a Roberto Alomar insert. Weaker of the two sets uh, from 2019. Obviously, Series 2 was just an absolute monster. But there are some nice guys in here. That's a Bray, Brian Anderson, Future Stars. Uh, we, didn't, we didn't luck up and hit any of them. But a ni pretty nice set nonetheless. Let's do 18. The 18 uh, Series 1. So you're going to have a bunch of nice rookies in this one. you got Rappi Devers, you have Walker Bueller, Ozzy Albies, Verdugo, Hoskins, Jack Flaherty. So this is a really nice set. This is Maxwell, Koji, Blackburn, Chancisco. There's a Silver Slugger Award. What is this? Uh, that's nothing. Um, Silver Slugger Award of Giancarlo Stanton, back when he was still with the Marlins. Cam uh, Cam Gallagher, Kershaw, Jose Bautista, Rodon, and Starling Marte. So still not much going on here, but we have some big packs upcoming, and then it looks like a nice little hit up here at the top. So let's do 2020, um, 
2020 Series 1. Really deep rookie class here, you know, with... You had Bo, you had Jordan, you had Lux, you had Kyle Lewis, you had Nico. Um, you had, you know, I'm thinking of thinking if I missed anyone else. You had Grisham and a Rosarina in their old jerseys. There's a Tony Gonsolin rookie. Not terrible. Kipnis. Oh, there we go. Bo Bichette rookie card. Very nice. So we get him in a sleeve. Got to, you know, definitely have my fair share of bows already, but you can never complain when you get yourself a bow there. Dubon, there's a Harper, there's Torres, there's a League Leaders of Cole back when he was still with the Astros. Ah, and an Acuna Gold. Very, very nice. You know, I've noticed, number to 2020, I've noticed that Acuna's had some pretty cool cards. Um, you know, the one this year where he's diving into the base. This one where he's, you know, throwing up the throwing up the horns. Um, you know, obviously his his rookie card is pretty iconic, even though he's just taking a swing. Uh, he's blocking these guys out. Let's, let's put Acuna over here. Uh, but he's had some really, really, really cool cards throughout the years. I was thinking about that the other day. This is a Kiki Hernandez and a Michael Chavez, or Chavez, Future Stars card. So let's get into these last few. Let's do 2010 update series. I think this is a bonus pack that was thrown into the box. So I don't know if I've ever opened much of this, but right off the top, there's a Jonathan Lucroy rookie. So Lucroy was a pretty nice catcher for a few years there. Carlos Santana, Kevin Millwood. Jeez, Kevin Millwood, that's a blast from the past. J.A. Happ, back with the Strohs. That's a Lance Zawa Zawadecki rookie card. Johnson, Rob Johnson, Chris Perez, what do we got here, a John Lackey gold, numbered to 2010, so a, a gold John Lackey, and then a Christy Matthews, what is this, Tops Attacks, Andrew Jones, so shout out to Triple B there, I know he's a big Andrew Jones guy, and then here's a Christy Matthewson. Vintage Legends insert. That's a pretty cool looking card too. I think it's uh, New York Giants, right? Is who we played for? Um, so very, very nice. Christy Mathewson insert card. All right, down to the last two packs. I'm gonna go Bowman. I'm gonna do 2017 next, even though it's not series one. Uh, there's some very nice stuff in 2017 update with, I believe Bellinger's in, in there and you know chasing some Judge cards, he's my guy. So right off the top here, we got a Trent Grisham rookie card. Just want to put my camera down slightly, get a little bit better angle. Rod uh, Escobar, Vado. Then there's a Braylon Marquez insert, nice. Gerard Encarnacion. I, I know who's next. He's pretty good. It's a Robert Poussin, very nice paper, but still very nice. There's a Nate Pearson. Oh, no, Anthony Volpe. First for the Yankees, very, very nice. And a John Diaz first, so two Chrome first, very nice. George Springer, Junior Fernandez, and a Tony Gonsolin. So we got a nice, nice little Bowman pack right there. A couple of nice Chrome firsts. You got the Poussin, and you got a couple of rookies in there. So very nice Bowman pack. All right, last pack, 2017 Tops update. Yeah, Joe Smith. Nolan Fontana, Matt Joyce, Kenley Jansen, Josh Reddick. Here's a Tim Anderson throwback jersey insert. Looks like it would be gold, but it's not. Rodney, Kyle Freeland. He's not a terrible, uh, terrible starter. Justin Bohr and Joe Jimenez. So none of the big guys out of there, no Bellinger, no Judge, no Moncada, um, but pretty nice. Anyhow, let's see what's in this envelope. Ah, very nice. A Gypsy Queen autograph of Colin Moran. So I'm not sure what Colin Moran is doing now, if he's still with the Pirates. I'm not even entirely sure. This is from Gypsy Queen in 20... 19 so yeah i'm not sure if moran is still playing with the pirates or if he's you know because he's even very successful in the league right now but this is very very nice uh to get a guaranteed hit so um 
Really nice little base box. Throw Moran in the back while I do my little recap here. So let's do it like this. We have the Christy Mathewson insert. We had a John Lackey gold, number to 2010. A Jonathan Lucroy rookie card out of 2010 update. Uh, Gonslin rookie. The Giancarlo insert. The Robbie Alomar and Ichiro throwback designs. Pretty cool. Evan White, Spencer Howard, Christian Javier rookies out of Series 1. A couple of Trouts out of 2020 update. A little Andy Page's action from Minor League. He's a very nice prospect. A lot of people like him a lot. I know LSU Maniac's really big on this guy. Uh, Kyle Freeland rookie out of 2017 update. Tony Gonslin rookie. The two Chrome firsts out of 2020 Bowman, John Diaz and Anthony Volpe. I really like that Anthony Volpe especially. The Robert Poussin first and Gerard Encarnacion first. So two of the uh, more sought after guys in that product as well. The Braylon Marquez uh, insert card, chrome insert from Bowman. And then a nice little Trent Grisham rookie out of Bowman. We had this Andrew McCutcheon uh, relic, Phillies relic out of, geez, what was this from? This might have been out of 2020 update, if I'm not mistaken. Um, number two, 199. So nice little relic there. The uh, uh, Ronald Acuna Jr. from 2020 Series 1 Gold, number 2, 2020. Number 700 out of 2020, pretty cool. So very nice card. A Bo Bichette rookie card out of the same pack, so the 2020 Series 1 pack was very, very nice. So there's Bo, the Bo Show. And then to wrap it all up, we have the Colin Moran inserted hit into the base box. So Colin Moran and a Gypsy Queen. The Gypsy Queen autographs, on-card autographs are really beautiful. That's the they, that's the reason to go after Hobby for Gypsy Queen. I, re, I really like Gypsy Queen. And, you know, high, re, very high-quality products. I think the price is going to be a bit high this year. Uh, but I probably won't be able to control myself, and I'll pick some up anyway. So, alrighty, That wraps up the base box for us. Um, so, you know, a big thank you to Ramiro for sending this along. You know, like I said, I think it's a very nice product uh, for the price point, especially kind of given where everything else is at these days. Um, so, you know, I will link to his page, you know, his YouTube page, and I think you may have a base box page on Facebook, so I'll try to find that, and I'll link it as well, so you guys can, you know, go check one of these out for yourself if you'd like to pick one up. Uh, but Ramiro's a really nice guy, and, you know, he does a good job with this kind of thing, so, you know, definitely give it a shot. Very nice product, the base box. So, thanks again, Ramiro, for sending this my way, and I probably will be back for future, future editions, so I definitely look forward to it. All right, everybody, so coming up soon, I have a little Throwback Thursday action with one of my Baseball Cardpedia throwback sets. Is it going to be an old Upper Deck uh, set this month? I have a bunch of mail here that I'm going to get into, some Donruss retail, some Heritage retail, a bun bunch of different stuff. So a lot coming up on the channel. Um, and the other thing I'd like to mention is, that, you know, thank you guys for, I already, I already surpassed 100 subscribers, so I did my 50 sub giveaway. And, um, you know, in the time that I did my 50 sub giveaway until the you know, winner was announced a week later, I basically reached 100, and I just recently surpassed uh, that milestone. So trying to think of what I want to do for a 100-sub giveaway, if anyone has any good ideas other than, you know, just give us all your Fernando Tatis Jr. and Ronald Acuna rookie cards or something, <laughs> um, you know, let me know. But I will definitely be doing something for you guys because I really appreciate all the support. Um, and, you know, we're just going to continue to keep growing the channel and doing some fun stuff here. So, you know, like I said, thanks again. Appreciate you bearing with all my ramblings here. And I will see you guys on the next one. So hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Throw me a thumbs up. And I'll see you on the next video. Take, thanks a lot, guys. Take care. Have a great night.